Blake is just, he's simply best at visualizing things. Uh, he's one of the most creative minds I know. And if he has an idea for something, he can describe it so well and in so much detail. The most vivid memory that comes to mind whenever I think of a time that, that Blake was there for me um, is when I was just going through a breakup, like happened that second. And I just remember calling him, crying, uh, needing him there and not really knowing where he was. And he went out and found me. I think the main two things that Blake is afraid of um, is the future and uh, his career. Oh God, his most beautiful feature. Ooh. I don't know, he's a snack. Like, that's like... <laughs>was there so my second semester sophomore year which was last spring semester um, had a lot of stuff just happening mainly I was working on a movie that was really stressful and my grandpa got diagnosed with kidney cancer in f February or March of this year so he was just there for the ups and downs a really big roller coaster for me personally but he was there he's a great guy uh, just leaning on him the whole time and there for one another. Yeah. He can have a lot of compassion for people he doesn't really know. So he has a very big capacity for people that he can just meet. And even if he doesn't know where somebody's coming from, he really tries to relate and try to, in a respectable manner, tries to really just, he loves when people lean on him. I think it's just a really respectful thing. Uh, his compassion for people, even when he's not close to them, is very, very just great. It's outstanding. it just like the way he is with me it's just like so natural like it was so random like the first night pretty much like i fell asleep where i was like went to his room we were watching like a comedy special and i just fell asleep on his bed on accident i wake up the next morning he's on the floor and then he pretty much got in bed because i was like i don't bite <laughs> and like we just like talked for four hours and it was kind of weird because like for some reason we just had like this compelling reason just like to tell each other like everything his most beautiful feature it's honestly, yeah, his personality and like just the way he thinks. Like I just really like the way he thinks sometimes. Like it just really like blows me away. Like one thing is, <laughs> I don't know why I'm like tearing up for it, but he'll like just like pick up matches, like matchboxes, and like he'll find stuff on the floor, like anywhere, like just randomly. Um, I feel like our relationship works really well, and like, like I said earlier, like, um, she's like, like yin and yang, like she like gives me those traits that like maybe I don't have, and she like teaches me how to be a better person, like, and like I help her with other stuff, and like, I don't know, it's just like a good relationship that I feel like will last long. Uh, honesty is a big thing for me. Um, I appreciate it, like, she will tell me what's on her mind, um, especially when it comes to, like, when we're both really busy with school and work, uh, I think it's vital for us to just be like, okay, well, this is how I feel right now, and, like, either I want to hang out or I don't. I really respect that. I also realize that I can be myself around here, her, and I didn't realize, like, what that truly meant until I started dating her. And so I really appreciate that. That's probably the thing I appreciate most in our relationship. Like the most beautiful aspect about her is that like, I know she trusts me because I, I'm a little more like abstract with how I express myself. And it's been really hard for me to like, show, like share my feelings with other people and like have them fully understand. But because she trusts me, I know she understands like when, if I need to do something, like I need to do this. And that's like really beautiful to me because it means like I'm giving and like she's giving into this relationship and we're making it work. I 
feel like our personalities just click. It's always comfortable to be around him from the beginning when we were coworkers. Like I just felt that energy of like, I can just talk to him. Like I don't need to put up walls. I don't need to like watch what I say around him. I know that like he will, it's a two way conversation ultimately. It's not like I'm talking to a wall and it's not like he's talking the whole time. Like there's a give and take to our relationship. And from the beginning, I felt that him as like a person I love his communication like just he's not afraid to be blunt and he's not afraid to say this is what I need from life and I appreciate that he's willing to just be truthful with me and be honest where a lot of people are afraid to like put their foot down and ask for what they need.